Hello everyone, welcome back to Altrius Plays Quake 2. We're playing the first mission pack that was released in 1998 called... I forgot what it's called, but the game title will tell you. The Reckoning. This is The Reckoning. So we've gone in through uh, different... We're infiltrating the strobe just like we were with the other characters, but we crash landed somewhere else. I have paused the game here because we've just stepped through the door, like I said I would. We found all the secrets. We do have our super secret super shotgun. Let's go. Hello. Nope. I'm not sure. Playing on nightmare mode, if you remember. So we will get the most benefit from being a little bit more cautious, a little bit more stealthy. Serving our ammo a little bit better than we were previously. Um, even on hard mode, the main game was, you know, kind of forgiving. Looks like we have to walk along there to get to that. So when we get back to this, which looks like the exit, but it might not be. Um, remember to look in there. Also, this does say exit on it, so when we find a level transition that looks like well, a door that looks like a level transition used to look like and we're like, why are you not a level transition? Well, they say exit now. Also, that's the thing that I was looking through before when we came through. I thought that might be a secret. Turns out, next level. It's got a little face in it I've never really noticed because I don't usually let them get that close to me. I'm a really angry bloke inside them. Flip here next. Ow. <laughs> I guess you'd probably be pretty angry as well if you were just sort of consigned to be a head in a cockpit of a tiny little drone rather than having any other life outside that is it's a full existence this looks like an open thing it's not saying it opens elsewhere i'm going to infer that because it doesn't open when i walk up to it Ooh. there's another super shotgun right here fine, <laughs> fine. This would be the place where we said to walk across there. So let's walk across there. Not a secret. Because why should it be? One of four secrets, and it was that one. Overflow doors open. I wonder what that was. Quick save because we keep making progress and I keep forgetting to do that. Quick save. Whoa. Excuse me. Drowning, but it's okay. Ah, it was this one. That um, that spinny thing, quite hard to avoid, actually, it turns out. So, yeah, I took a bit of damage on that one. By the way, if you press space to swim up, you're in a lot worse position than if you just look upwards and swim. You do not swim upwards as fast as you swim upwards. Nice to have a little bit of a uh, defense in the sense of a good offense against these losers, isn't it? Come on then. You take too many shots. Probably could have got it away with a grenade for that one, but I don't like grenades until I have a grenade launcher. It's just it's really hard to deal with. <laughs> ah, okay, well, we'll think about that. Access denied. Well, look, I'm important, let me in. Also, very that was weird. <laughs> Don't you think that was weird? What is happening here? Access valve A open. Where are we going? This. I was talking about the intricacy of the the last level of the main game, right? I was talking about the palace and how it 
looped in along itself and did this and that and the other, and each area had multiple entryways and stuff. This this level already seems maybe more complex than that. No. <laughs> Let me out. It's, it's pulling me down, I swear it. Yeah, no, it really is. Uh, what's this for? It's a ladder! You can climb this pipe. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that was a bit of a waste. It's okay. This is valve B open. It's probably the, uh... Ah, oh, jeez! Wow. <laughs> Even that! What a pest! But the similar traps in the previous game, like when we found the secret level on the satellite... Not nearly quite so... Subtle? There's subtlety to that, right? Do you know what I mean? Because uh, in in that level, you had to break the thing, and like, I didn't do it. But if you um, if you didn't turn off the good, if you didn't turn off the switch at that point. So if you didn't break the power connection, you would just get stuck through and you'd be killed. Right? But that fan just slowly pulling you down. I like it. Who's smart? This door is opened elsewhere. I feel like I should be allowed through that door because I managed to get there. Here, the slicey bloke. Yeah, and they're not flinching. Definitely causes more issues. Take a lot less damage when they uh, when they fall over temporarily. <laughs> My grenade finished them both off when they middle of a fight. That was both amazing and also kind of rude of me. I think. Like, can we not settle this like gentlemen? Like, no, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna set this in here. I'm not supposed to have this much armor. Oh, jeez. Hey, remember all those enemies that we introduced you to slowly? Here they are in a different order, and also. they hate you. <laughs> More. <laughs> Ah, that's what that was. Got chair. One moment, please. Get up earlier in the morning than that, mate. A door has opened. Come on. You can get in there. Nice. See, that's the sort of secret I like. You go a little bit further, you follow a semi-obvious route. What's the computer doing? Uh, and then it's just there. There you go. Well done. You've, you've achieved it. I haven't hidden it behind a, an impossible-to-find button. No, the, or the thing that you're supposed to shoot. You've shot. Oh, what? Therefore, here's your reward. Remember to look under lifts. Utopia. Okie dokie. Excuse me? Baking powder? What is that thing? Jewel fire damage. It's a quad, but half as much maybe? It probably does the lift, yeah. Oh, come on. Are you going up and down on your own, or do I have to press it again? You can save it there. Found some stuff. Got some stuff done. Okay. So why is there a slicey man voice? There you go. Um... 
Go to override, exit airlock open. Oh, I guess I couldn't go through the exit. Probably. I didn't even try, because I was like, there must be something else to do before we get there. Kill enemy resistance. Uh, I believe you mean to say, kill all the things. This game predates that meme. It's crazy. It almost predates the concept of memes, don't you think? Hello. Let's not do this. Where I stand in the grenades. Just let you... Uh... Yep. I'm sure I saw the shot from one of them. Hello? Um, I'm expecting mutants, basically, because there's caves. Caves equals mutants. I'm calling them mutants. Meh. Not as interesting as not going that way. This is very hexen. Oh, we're back in level one. Which is why there's another secret, because we've... See, they didn't do that before, either. Oh, reverb. Um, early on, the game was very linear. In the in the main mission, in fact. Ow. Um to the point where it was basically mission, mission, mission. And I was actually saying, I'm not sure if we ever actually go back to uh, previous levels in this game, and then immediately we went to a previous level. But Normally, this means go on top. Nothing here seems to want to break. This jump. Those are pushing this. Knew it, didn't I? Was I not looking directly at that? And how did it miss me that well? <laughs> Terrible. Now I can go in here. Aha! Uh -huh. I knew I wasn't supposed to explode it. I'm feeling smug about that. So well done, me. Um, save game. What did it say? It just said something. Ooh, a new button type. Oh, Christ. Two shots from this is enough. That's at least nice to know. Bridge extended. Ah. You know what? It is my solemn duty to kill enemy resistance, and that seems to be you. So, get killed enemy resistance. Also, I want to look under that. Hang on. Okay. <laughs> I'll let you off. Just opens the door? Just opens the door. I like that door. I like that it's got sort of the uh, extra bit inside it going on. Press this button the second time. It comes back up. I feel like that means I should be able to use it multiple times. Oh, it means because it's the lift. Yeah. I I I'm saving it sort of on a... We found the last secret. I'm saving it sort of out of habit right now. Ah, we know what these mean. Found all the secrets. I have never seen this area before. Okay, as well you to know, that's how good I am at this game. Um, missed some kills in the first level. That was the level we were just in. I, basically, I probably could have gone around and killed some more, but I didn't. Where are we? Where I am. Exiting wilderness area. Okay, fair enough. Should we play Quake 4? I know that it's it's in this sort of weird interim era where it's not the amazing graphics and stuff of like Doom Eternal and what have you, but it's not the retro graphics here. I'm thinking, stop it. Discover location of Strogue Counter Strike Fleet. Um. <laughs> You notice how they keep crouching and doing a natural jump. I'm wondering if this is a uh, new behaviour in this mission pack. All these enemies. Which is cool. I'm down with that. 
Um, you know, I don't remember if Quake 4's story was really that great, or if it was just a retelling of Quake 2's story or something like that. I don't know. I don't really want to take that just yet. Okay, hello? Welcome, hello? I do like one thing that they do in this um, game and sequence of mission patterns. It's that they use the edge of the world as sort of a place to bring enemies in from. Um, when they want to spawn enemies but there's an outside area, they just fly across the top. It's brilliant. They come in from the sky. I mean, it's, it's very common in games that you need to set up an ambush. You, know, you need some way of getting enemies that don't exist in the world to exist in the world. Uh, and what the heck? You got <laughs> By having them fly in from overhead is very in keeping with the the nature of the game, I suppose, and, and also I just really like the concept. Can you stop? You must have got a job to do, and you're just really hindering them. Okay. I can see that you tried to do a thing. Look, if, unless you're going to be a pro gamer platformer gamer. Don't even bother with it. What are we doing here? It says, join the remaining members of Find Data. Right, so these will be the remaining members of the strike team. Because <laughs> uh, that was the data CD. Base intelligence. It's a bit much that you get to have that weapon. Also, it's, it's got blue charges. So, desist. <laughs> This is with your game breaking OP weapon ring. So you just honor an AOE on that thing. Like a limit to your power. I don't add them and need it, mate. Look, there's a button there. Don't ask me how I saw that button. I may just be primed from having recently played the uh, the other one. Hey. Stop that. We've got new enemy types, so new enemy behaviour is not completely inconceivable, right? What? You were just right there, huh? <laughs> Could be used to that sort of thing. Rookie mistake, just... What are you? I assume you're an enemy. <laughs> You didn't seem to be attacking me, but I shot you anyway. Stop hurting me with these OP weapons. I says tonight, so I'm supposed to be here. There are four secrets. Keep finding places. And <laughs> Yay, secret. No. Yay, secret. No. Right, I guess I'm going up there then. I'm gonna push this? No. Pull down go boom, but I can't push it. Um <laughs> Reckon you can get onto that? I don't think you can. Ooh, got on that <laughs> I don't think you can do that. Also, there's a whole other bit of level to look at. Not quite sure how to get up there. Hey. Why are you not dying from my super shotgun? It's what it's for. Oh, 
Whoops! <laughs> <laughs> Look too close to my own weapon. Look, they've locked me in. Freaking losers. Save all the alarm. Oh, that's neat. I like that a lot. That reminds me of the start of uh, Prey. What you? We have less damage on our first computer. Ah! Did I turn this? <laughs> it felt like I turned the music off. Probably afford to not worry about my shotgun shells too much. At least for a while. Health, however. Big problem. I've got an adrenaline in backup. Whoa. I don't know if we move the same speed in all directions. I'm going to give you the opportunity, mate. Soz. Not the Get out of here. Whoa! Where were we? Oh, I guess we're restarting that level. <laughs> this one? Alright, I guess I'll see you in a minute when I've played all that again, because I went from not safe scumming to not saving at all. I went possibly safe scumming to not saving. <laughs> Alright, I'm pressing on through this bit, but I haven't been back to do the stuff we did last time we went through. I, I basically took a different direction. It's another double up the power region. We should be using them. Is one per level? We should just be using one per level. I haven't actually given that thing the opportunity to not kill me. So I'm shooting it. Ow! You're a trespasser. That is too hard! <laughs> Do you know what? Just take that. I'm gonna flip in and use it. Oh, double fire rate. Nice. Or double damage. Uh, still dying a lot. <laughs> From now. Man, this is really hard. Although I didn't know what that was going to do, to be fair. So, now that I have some... Okay. We know what we're doing. Yeah, this wasn't too safe, Scummy, right? Because... So we're supposed to do that? Nothing's just been ignoring me this whole time. Hmm? Ah. Is it that? Maybe. Take it gently. Seem to have gone away. Yeah, it 
was that? Okay. Should I fall down? <laughs> Seems dangerous. Should I save it? I've still got 89 health for once. Yeah, let's try it. Save the HP, I'm not jumping down now. Okay, so I just got back the thing that I used. Jewel fire damage. So damage? I'm wondering if these things are like What are you? They seem to be just operating the computers, but maybe if we destroy them all? Maybe they count as kills? That took so long to go up that I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to do this. Yeah. Power shield. Now I just need power. Got 50. Presumably I had 50 in it. I think we learned that last time, actually. Take care, because I'm not sure if there's a way of... Deactivating those lasers. <laughs> Good job, Boulder. Again, with the complexity of these early levels in this mission pack, it's crazy. Good crazy. Look, I'm finding a... This is an exit, right? Yeah. This is not. Ow. Dislike. Right, okay. This is the, okay. This is a place. Now I might cut out a little bit more. So I suspect that I'm now going to go to the other part of the level where the base CD was. And also, I'm going to try and figure out how to get up there. Okay. Stop spawning baddies everywhere. Turn the corner, and there's another one. Get out of it. Weird that this is like just everything's at the same level up there. It's just a minor level design consideration from having read like one magazine in 2002 <laughs> about the subject. Right, let's try this. What do you want me to do? Does this break? It's got fragile there. This place. Ha ha ha! That's how you do it. The first one falling was a clue, the other ones were falling. Stop. I'm going to pass. Now we've got a grenade launcher. So. 55 of 62, and then... Yeah, okay, that can. So we want to do that. I just got no head, by the way. Is okay? Oh, right, you then. Noisy. Shut up. <laughs> uh, do I need to find? Them? I'm gonna go and kill them things, and then see what's next. We may come back here. We may not. I don't know. Oh, there's still. Right, I haven't spawned in the enemies. No, I have. Kind of weird, actually. I'm pretty sure. Um, already dealt with that situation. What? Smeg off! <laughs> what a flipping mess. Oh, 
right. What means that? 60 of 62. They literally spawned in whilst I was doing that. Um, I don't know what this does, so I'm going to... Find the others. I'm guessing I can pick two or three of these. <laughs> I don't know what the third one is, but it might have been a weapon. Those seem like a very good two things to have landed on, however. Right. It's actually I've actually done this level even though I've never seen it before. That's amazing. Very much a fan of that. Uh, we talk about that, by the way. It just is an overhang. You want to get to it? Rude. Seems like another time to end the episode. Thank you for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. And I'm going to go through this door next and start episode three. But until then, I hope that you are enjoying playing through this brand new content. It's not brand new. It's from 1998 as much as I am. But it's new to me and I hope it's new to you. If you are enjoying it, please consider leaving a like and a subscription to the channel to see the rest. See more coming up. And leave a comment if you have anything to say about how badly I'm playing. But until next time, thank you for watching. Whether you leave a comment, subscribe or like or not. I'll see you next time.